Greetings, gentlemen. RC model well, geeks. I was going to say gentle folks. <laughs> <laughs> Bigs the Phil's here. Hello. And here we are in the shed yet again for part two of the Hobby King F16 build. So we've been quite busy, haven't we, Phil? Yeah. Yep. Um, we've got the servo in the wing. Uh, and all mounted up and working lovely jubbly and we've also got the uh, the wing joiner which is there uh, glued in on that one wing and that looks all uh, nice and good and uh, slot free there's no play in there at all and um, <laughs> Yeah, we used um, uh, control links from uh, from Flight Comp for uh, for that setup there, and uh, here's one that's nearly finished. Yep. So you can see the general arrangement. It's just got a ball link at one end, and then these preformed uh, Z bends, which are brilliant actually, um, at the other end. Uh, and that works quite well for this setup. So that's as far as we have got so far today. Uh, the final thing I've got to do on this second wing is just uh, drop the uh, cover on the floor so Phil can pick it up. <laughs> it's a different colour. It's a different colour. Well spotted, Phil. You haven't <laughs> lost it, have you? No. <laughs> <laughs> is uh, make that fit over there. Now, the way I got it secured, because uh, obviously you don't want to glue it on, because that's a pain in the arse when you want to get to it again. Um, if you look, I just used two screws on that one, and the screws basically screw into the uh, hardwood blocks that are there to hold that servo in. So that just sticks over there, two screws through, Bob's your uncle, it's on, and done. Um, so yeah, so final thing probably to do on this, that I've got to glue the hinges in on the, on that one, and, uh, and paint that. And that's it. I thought I'd paint them black, because uh, the white, I oh know the white just look naff, I think the white black looks better, even though it shows up more. It looks more sort of military-like, doesn't it, I think? Oh, yeah. Than the white. Now, uh, <laughs> talking of colours and stuff, um, the paint on this plane is a nightmare. Um, the way they've done it, the um, these wings are actually a foam core with uh, balsa uh, covering on them. And then uh, to make a base for the paint... They've covered it in heat shrink film. Mm. You know, your normal modelling heat shrink film. Mm. And then they've painted on top of it. Unfortunately, because the uh, the film was all nice and shiny, um, the paint doesn't stick to it. And it's flaking away. So any, any kind of touch, and this happens. Mm. You can see the shiny bloody paint underneath. Um, yeah, I mean, it's only on the wing and the tail plane that it does it, because uh, those are the only two bits that are covered in uh, model covering. Um, this one's faring slightly better at the moment, but I'm sure after it's had a bit more handling, um, uh, that'll be worse as well. You can just see the edge of the cover in there. Mm. So, uh, yes, that's a right pain in the, in the arse. Uh, and of course, without the exact paint, you know, you touch it up, it's just going to look stupid unless you respray the whole thing. But anyway, it's battle scars, isn't it? Eh? But it, it wouldn't be perfect in the real world, would it, Phil? No, 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 no bullet holes. <laughs> <laughs> you and you, you and disaster. I went to the armaments machine today. Oh, the old armaments museum yeah. up on Portsdown Hill. Brilliant, it's worth a visit. Really? Yeah, it's really good. What did they have up there then? Lots of poppies. Really? And loads and loads and loads of guns. Loads of guns? Yeah. That's weird for an armoury, isn't it? Yeah. Did they have any leggeries? Any what? Leggeries. What are leggeries? Well, they had armouries. 
Oh, God. Oh, no. <laughs> they have legaries, too. Get on with it. <laughs> oh, God. We're going flying tonight, aren't we? Probably. Yep. Yep. Well, the swallow phoned up and said, uh, why ain't anybody flying? Now, I've been flying already today. I've had three good takeoffs and two good landings. Right, so um yeah, we're just gonna finish off the final bits on uh, on this and then uh, probably go flying or something, we'll see. Probably won't be any video. Um Colin's not here. Colin's not here and uh and such is life. And I'd rather be flying than taking video. Sorry. So, uh, yes, yeah, so I'm going to paint that, cut it out, get it on there. Bob's your uncle, and that will be, I will stick that bit of uh, joiner in there. And then that'll be uh, job, job for the day. Yeah. Back soon. Okay, there is the second wing uh, all completed. Oh, no, it's not. We haven't stuck the bit of uh, stuff in there, have we, Phil? No, the bit of wood. No, a bit of um, whatever it is, phenolic resin. That. Yeah. Well, That's got to be glued into there. That is wood, isn't it? No. Isn't it? No. Oh. So it isn't. It's a bit of something different. Mm. Yeah, so she's got to glue that in there and then we'll call it a day. So, uh, should we mix some glue up, Phil? Yeah, okay. And we'll get that in there, eh? So, there you go. That is both wings completely finished with their uh, joiner glued in and everything. So yeah, looking uh, looking quite uh, good. Um, it's weird, this underneath part, the paint has stuck nicely. On this top, it's just coming off like a bastard. Look at that. It's flaked straight off. And the same, yeah, well, there you go on that one. Um, not a lot can do about it, really. Uh, if the plane flies okay, then I might think about repainting it. But uh, apart from that, I'm not going to. So that's it for the day. End of part two. Uh, hopefully part three tomorrow if the postman turns up. So I'll see you all then. Thank you for watching Captain Rob's RC Model Geeks. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to click that like button. If you want to see more of the same type of videos, don't forget you can subscribe. If you want to support us, you can use PayPal, paypal.me forward slash RC Model Geeks. If you want to contact us, you can email us rcmodelgeeks at gmail.com We look forward to seeing you in the next video.